Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2018 Panini Donruss Optic Football. This is a six box, half case, random team break number two from jazbeescasebreaks.com. One spot gets you two teams in a six box break. Also, in a separate dice roll, there is the St. Nick promo right there. Someone's going to get one of those gifts in the background. It might be you, it might be someone right here. All right, so one spot gets you two teams that so will double you up. All football teams are in. So for this dice roll, four and a five, nine times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ninth and final time after nine times. Isaac down to Josie. Four and a five, nine times for the teams. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, we've got the Jacksonville Jaguars down to the Cincinnati Bengals. All right, so Isaac with the Jags, Brandon, last spot mojo, Niners and Steelers, Anthony with the Falcons, Jeremy with the Chiefs, Allen with the Panthers. Arthur Hackett, you got the Browns. Jeremy with the Packers. Patrick with the Chargers. Patrick K with the Seahawks. Greg with the Giants. Jeremy with the Jets. Chase with the Cowboys. John with the Eagles. Jeremy with the Rams. Chase with the Cardinals. Patrick N with the Lions. John with the Colts. Patrick K with the Broncos. Arthur with the Texans. Jeremy with the Vikings. Greg with the Buccaneers. Josie with the Saints. John Edney with the Patriots. Patrick K with the Titans. Um, Jeremy S. Dolphins, Isaac with the Bills, Allen with the Raiders, Anthony with the Ravens, John with the Redskins, Patrick K with the Bears, and Josie, you have the Bengals. Let's alphabetize by team. Let's get everything on one screen. There we go. Trades are allowed, so if you want to do a trade, let me know. Speak now, forever hold your peace. Remember, we marked all of these two right here for random team two. Let's see, do I, do I need a check? I don't think I need a checklist, but let me drop the checklist for you if you're watching live in the chat. Let's check it out if you want to keep track of what you could potentially get. There you go. Group break checklist does a nice job at organizing everything by, uh, by teams. And cardboardconnection.com is great for, to, look up, uh, to look up hits by insert set. All right, no trades. Doesn't look like it. All right, TWC trade window closed. Let's print. Let's rip. Good luck, everybody. We've got full case. Pick your teams in the store, ladies and gentlemen, so check those out. We're almost in single digits on the next full caser. All right, there's the um, official printout on the 20th on a Thursday. No football, no football tonight. I thought there was going to be some football tonight, but no. Two games on Saturday. Good luck, boys and girls. Um, we were discussing a little bit of the games yesterday. Oh, is Duke playing tonight? Let me check out some Zion. Um, we talked a little bit about this yesterday. Redskins, Titans. Redskins at Titans. Titans are minus 10. Now, I think the Titans will win straight up. But by, by 10, over 10? Not sure. Redskins have a decent defense. They've been playing some tough football. I feel like they'll be scrappy. I don't think they're going to win. But maybe this is a Redskins plus 10 situation here. That might be the a sharp play. Double digit points. The point total is 37. That might be one of the lowest point totals I've seen in a while. Especially in this offense-driven league. So minus 10 when the total is only 37. 
your implied score on that can't be very high. So unless Titan's defense really steps up, I don't know, I'm liking that plus 10. I don't know, maybe I'll have an official pick for you by tomorrow. But I'm leaning that I'm leaning plus 10. EA, what do you think? Tighten up, he said. Listen, I think the Titans are going to win. If, you're going, if you want to go money line, if you want to lay a lot of money on that, probably a minus 500 on that or something like that, you know, sure, go for it. I feel pretty confident about that. But minus 10? Unless, unless uh, Derrick Henry just goes, just goes nuts? Well, I guess the implied, I guess would be that. Josh Pru saying the implied would actually be 27 to 10. All right, fair enough. <laughs> I felt like minus 10 is a lot for that kind of number, though. All right, Cortland Sutton to 299. I guess if I believe in the under. And there's Cortland Sutton again. So that Cortland Sutton parallel will sleeve and top load. Our shipping team will take care of that later on. Right now, the Cortland Sutton on-card auto, though. Is 18 out of 75. That'll get sleeved and top loaded right away. Patrick K with the Broncos, little Oppo Joe Mojo. I actually have a. Excuse me, now, now I'm curious. Because there's there's a way to. There's a way to calculate those um, those implied lines, or what Vegas thinks the score will be based off of uh, what the over under is. I have it in a spreadsheet somewhere. Bear with me here, folks. Do I have it here in this spreadsheet? So if the underdog is by 10, 37, so they're saying, they're suggesting, I think Josh is pretty close, they're, Vegas is suggesting that the favorite should be winning 33 to 13. But yeah, that's probably a stay away on that. You, never, you, don't, know, you don't know what's going to happen. Probably the under. <laughs> There's Malik Jefferson for the Bengals at a 299. Now this guy might just go off and just destroy, right? There's Mitch Trubisky to 199. Nice Calais Campbell gold. Two out of ten. Now uh, these lower numbered ones out of ten. We'll protect those right away. Jaguars, that goes to Isaac and the Jags. Nice. crazy thing is the Vikings have an outside or Vikings uh, I was look, reading what Josh was saying uh, the Redskins have an outside chance at a playoff spot they're seven and seven what about the uh, what about the other Saturday game Ravens Chargers and then we'll check out what Josh thinks about that Vikings game what about Ravens Chargers Chargers are minus four that's kind of a weird number they're minus four point total is 44. Royce uh, Freeman. EA says Chargers. All right, box two. This is Random Team 2, folks. Half case Random Team 2. Nothing is sold out after this, so if you want to do full casers of these, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got plenty of other stuff on the website, too. jazbeescasebreaks.com. So Jay's car, Jay ne needs the Chargers to win? Why do you need the Chargers? Did you, have you made a financial investment on that professional ball club? Proust is taking the over on that game. I'm bad with over-unders. I, I now always stay away from those. Ah, I see. Because Jay's saying because Pittsburgh's chances in New Orleans are pretty slim. So he's, he needs a little help from the Chargers to beat the Ravens. It's going to be an interesting game. Chargers' secondary is pretty good, I want to say. 
I'm not sure if their run defense is that great. And Ravens like to run a lot, so let's we'll see what happens. I don't know, maybe under in that game, Josh. I don't know. Don't listen to me. I'm bad at over-unders. But maybe the under? Guys are running a lot. The Ravens are running a lot. Ravens defense is pretty good, too. Melvin Gordon, I think, is back. No way over on that. Yeah, don't listen to me. Point totals, I'm terrible at point totals. I don't, I don't mess around with those. According to my sources here, the sharp money apparently is on the on the under in that. 59% of the public on the under. 88% of the money is on the under in this game, which is a 29% difference right there. So more sharp money on the under for whatever that's worth. But Josh Bruce saying the Ravens will go on the road and score over 20. Lamar Jackson has been playing pretty well. 28 out of 99, Anthony Miller. It's a nice one for the Bears, Patrick K. Tyler Conklin for the Vikings out of 199. Oh, are they moving the Colts-Titans game to Sunday night? That should be a pretty good game, I think. All right, now Josh was saying that he thinks that the Vikings game is going to be a good play. Who are they playing? Vikings are an early game. Right, Josh is saying Ravens will score like 6 or 25. Uh, Vikings are at, there's Kyle Laletta Gold. Vikings are uh, at the Lions. At, they're in Detroit. Minnesota is a road favorite, minus 6. Total is 42.5. Nice, that's for the New York football giants. That goes to Greg Esfang. Finally using this guy a lot more, Vikings. There's Sony Michelle at a 149. Wait, so is that a uh is that a New Year's Eve game, EA? Sunday night? I guess I guess it is, isn't it? No, New Year's Eve is Monday night. Oh, if you're traveling, I don't know where they are. Are they playing at home or what? Hayden Hurst, 299. Purple Birds. TB12. Two out of 199. Just 10 off that jersey number, as usual. Famous Jameis Winston at 149. There's Mariota right there. These downtown cards apparently are doing pretty well in the secondary market. There's Jabril Peppers for the Browns out of 299. Browns still have an outside chance too, right? Playoff spot. <laughs> this is true, Josh. Yeah. When Vegas thinks you're when when you're like the Lions and you're a six point dog at home, Vegas definitely thinks you suck. What did the what did the Lions do from here? They're five and nine. You know, uh, you know they're probably not going to win this one. They'll be five and ten after this week with one more game. Maybe five or six wins by the time everything's done. How old is Stafford? I don't know. They got they got their, their they got their guy, I guess. They got their coach. Let's see how that works out. Maybe some some someone for Matt Stafford to throw to would be nice. They took away Golden Tate from him. So maybe they're they'll be 
going receivers in the draft, pass catchers in the draft. I feel like they got an okay running back situation. I don't know what else they need to do. We shore up on that defense. Patricia will show up on shore up that defense. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Jay. I think it's a very slim chance, but I think I think we we now live in a world, yeah, where the Browns have a chance at the playoffs in Week 16. This is real life, not fantasy. You're not caught in a landslide. No escape from reality. Open your eyes. Look up to the sky and see. You can see that the Browns. <laughs> Mathematically, have a chance. I think they need a lot of help, but but winning their last two games are going to help big time for them. I don't know. Baker Mayfield in the playoffs would be kind of exciting, though. All right, the autographs have been popping out early here. There's Royce Freeman, another Bronco, more Oppo Joe Mojo for Patrick K. That is 20, 28 out of 35. That downtown Ronald Jones, by the way, went to Greg, who has the Buccaneers. Kalen Bellage out of 199. Let's see if we can find maybe like a, a train whistle parallel in here. Jay would love to see the Browns knock Baltimore out of the last game of the season. The Brown sweep of the Ravens this year. That would be that would be a good game for the hobby. Lamar Jackson against Baker Mayfield. Just see those guys go off. Hashtag good for the hobby. There's Equinamia St. Brown out of 299. Packers with that one. DeAndre Hopkins. At a 299. Josh Norman, Redskins, 299. There's Matt Stafford and Auden Tate for the Bengals, 299. Devontae Adams, Packers, to 299. Alex Collins and Davenport. All right, we are halfway through this half case break, ladies and gentlemen. Random team break number two from jazbeescasebreaks.com. I think we might have some more random teams posting, posted maybe already. We definitely have full case breaks available right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Check it out. Josh is leaning baseball, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to go with that. That's also on jazbeescasebreaks.com. There's the RPA. Any guesses on that? It's a one per case, I think. I know it might have TJ. <laughs> Finding those two one of ones out of that case. Now he's got it set has set the one of one bar pretty high. Alright, next one. Fans of the game, Matthew Berry, that'll obviously go to the Redskins. Sony Michelle out of two ninety nine. Jameson Crowder, two ninety nine. Antonio Brown to 99. Denzel Ward also to 99. Andrew Luck. 
that is to 50. Andrew Luck's been playing some good football as of late. Colts might get into the playoffs. Playoffs? Playoffs? Talking playoffs? Travis Kelsey, illusions insert. Shaquem Griffin to 199, Seahawks. Melvin Gordon should be healthy, right? On the 299, he'll be playing this weekend, playing Saturday. All right, behind DeAndre Hopkins is Hayden Hurst, 14 out of 15. Nice patch, nice autograph, nice one for the Purple Birds. Anthony. Two boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. More in the store, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Check it out for good times and great oldies, K Earth 101. Stuff has been really nice. Optic football, I think from the get go, from year one, he's done a solid job on this product. a handful of orders coming in as well, ladies and gentlemen, so keep up that momentum. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Remember, due to our holiday schedule, tonight and tomorrow night are our last two nights of, uh, last two full nights of breaking. Jared Goff to 199. Baker Mayfield to 299. Allen's here. Allen needs Panthers and Raiders in this one. There's Calvin Benjamin Blue for the Bills to 149. Josh Cruz is wondering if we can pick one break to agree on and focus on that and knock something out. Ooh, Russell Wilson downtown. That's pretty cool. That goes to the Seahawks. Patrick K. There's Matthew Stafford. It's the classic collective action issue, Josh Cruz. Get everybody on the same page. You know what's even easier, though? Is if everybody joins every single break. Just buys one spot in each. It'll be done before you know it. Damian Ratley, Browns. Now to go to Arthur Hackett and the Cleveland Browns. Just get one of each, everybody. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. We'll be done. Easy. I guess that's what da downtown Seattle looks like. Antonio Callaway to 149 for the Browns. Browns need to bring that little elf back. Bring that elf back, Browns. And there you go. Damian Ratley was your autograph. And the last box, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. Random Team 2, almost in the books. A St. Nick gift being given away at the end of this one.
All right, good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Random team two. Last box, last autograph. When is figure team three, Owen's at? Whenever it sells out, Owen. That's all. That will always be the answer. I don't know when any of these breaks are going to happen. When is always a weird question because it's such a spontaneous thing. And the answer is always whenever it sells out. So it could have that pick your team three could happen in a minute. People could rally around it, and all of a sudden it's gone. That could ha be done in five minutes, or it could be done in five hours. I don't know. Oh, nice. Mark Mark Matheson back in the house saying Revolution Basketball down to one. All right, so that looks like that's going to be the next break of the night. Nice, because nothing else is filled up after this. What team is left, Mark, on that Panini Revolution Basketball? All right, last box here. Good luck, boys and girls. We got John Kelly red to 99, one out of 99. Raptors are left, nice. Kawhi Leonard autographs in there. Dak Prescott, 299. Auden Tate for the Bengals out of 199. And Sam Darnold is your rated rookie autograph out of here. In the last box, Jets, 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 Jeremy S. With the Jets. 9 out of 35. Nice one. Good way to end this break. There's Josh Allen to 299. Matt Stafford, Black Velocity at a 25 for the Lions. Devontae Adams to 149. Calvin Ridley, rated rookie card at the end. And there you have it. It's a nice way to end it. All right, now. Go back to round. Let's get the original names here in this break. Let's get the remaining box numbers here. So remember, folks, any break that says St. Nick in the title you could get one of those Christmas gifts back there at the end of the break. Let's randomize each of those lists five and a two, seven times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And final time. Congrats to Jeremy S. with a Darnold and a Christmas gift from Jaspies. Look at that. All right. Well, let's see what you're going to get. Box name on box on top after seven times will be yours. One, two, three, four, five, six. And seventh and final time. Box on top. Box 11. Box 11. There's a box 11. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas, Jeremy. Let's see what we got for you.
one box inside and it's wow that's very nice that's a box of 2018 tops five star baseball jeremy if you end up ripping this open let me know what you end up getting. That's very nice. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. St. Nick came early this year. Visited Jazbees early this year. Dropped off a bunch of presents. Check it out. Uh, and good luck to the next person. Thanks, everybody.